What's happening, people? It is your boy Richard Sales Official. Welcome back to the channel. Um, again, so many highly recommended videos for me to react to, but something that I've done quite a few times on TikTok is reacting to animals that seem bigger than what we actually realize. Let's just get straight into it and see if we're surprised by some of the things that we're going to encounter. So make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for recommending these videos for the channel and let's just get straight into it. Well, I'm excited, you know. The earth was a land of giants. Oh, My prehistoric animals had the tendency to grow to humongous proportions. Oh, what is that? I don't exactly know. Oh, I these are films. What the but these giants died down long ago. However, there are still giants roaming the Oh, these are today, films. And most of which are commonly known and some quite bizarre. Oh. Others are known and still bizarre, like the number one entry, so you should stay tuned for that one. Right, okay. Here are ten giant creatures caught on Ooh, camera. I'm scared, you know. With all that said and done, let's begin, shall we? Whoa, 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 whoa. Number ten. Number ten, here we go. The Strange Blob of Acapulco. What the In hell this is modern that? day and age, people still believe that giant unidentified monsters still what the hell is that? The water worldwide. In fact, it seems that advances in oh, the no, 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 no. I'd be have gone. reinvigorated the search for these legendary Look creatures. Look at the ducks just sitting there. That and the fact that stuff like these get washed up on the beaches worldwide. What Back is in that? March of 2016, a 13-foot unidentified blob from the sea washed up on a beach in Acapulco, Mexico. Some oh scientists believe the creature to be a whale and others a squid. And of it's course, massive. people on the internet think it's a terrifying monster. Whatever it is, the creature appears to have died shortly before beachgoers discovered it. Oh my Though god. it was not fully decomposed, it was well on its way. Number 9. Right, okay. A giant anaconda. Oh no, I don't like snakes! If there's at least one thing that you don't want oh to see my... while working at a construction site is a giant anaconda. And that's oh, exactly it's what me, these it's construction me go workers weird. came across while doing some construction work in the Cape of Altamira in the northern state of Para, Brazil. What is wrong with people? They discovered the giant snake immediately after setting off a controlled explosion. At 33 feet long and weighing 63 stone, or 462 pounds, oh, it is one of the largest my. anacondas ever seen, dead or alive. After making the frightening discovery, the workers Look chained the, the animal size. to a crane and later lifted it up to reveal its yellow spotted underbelly, a move which was criticized in the comments. Look at the size! What is wrong with this world? People say the builders killed the snake rather than leave it in its natural habitat, but this has not Well, that's not, not very confirmed. nice, is it? Others believe the animal may have died in the explosion, possibly being hit by falling debris as its head appeared flat in the video footage. Yeah, that looks a bit... Number 8. Oh god, my heart. The Jacksonville Dino. Dinosaur. Not many dinosaur sightings have been reported in the past few years. Highly understandable because is that um, that's not real. We didn't is already it? know these giant reptiles have been extinct for millions of years. Mate, raptors are scary. But despite let me tell you now, if anybody's watched any Jurassic Park films, their claws and their mating court, yeah, that instantly sends shivers down my whole body. Despite that fact, there is still oh, a God. very large number of people that believe in the possibility that some of these creatures somehow managed to survive to this very day. Surely existing not. Existing in secret in some far-flung, unexplored jungle, or at the bottom of a particularly deep and murky lake, or standing in plain sight in downtown Jacksonville, Florida. The video looks like it's that of a reporter covering some story in downtown Jacksonville. Some sound must have startled them because they suddenly panned the camera to look over the fence into what looks like a construction site when they saw the large reptile. The camera was so shaky that we can't really see if the thing was moving. That's, that's not, that's so, not real. did they really capture a giant dinosaur? No, in they didn't! Or was this video uploaded at around the same time as the construction of a dinosaur attraction in the Jacksonville Zoo and was done to promote the thing? Come on it now! The ladder. Number 7. Right. A cassowary. When big birds are the topic of a conversation, big, ostriches and a certain giant yellow bird from Sesame Street come to mind. The subject of this entry on our list doesn't get much love, oh. which is quite unfair, really, because they're pretty Jesus. fascinating creatures. They're fast as they well. being cassowaries, a large, flightless bird, much like the ostrich. Oh, they can't fly. Scientists say that they are Thank direct God. descendants of the dreaded Velociraptors, and their ferocious reputation shows this relation. You see, they are far from being mild-mannered. In this video, you can see one of these giant birds attacking a zookeeper who's trying to desperately defend himself with Jesus a Jesus Christ. I don't know what's more terrifying. The fact that those legs end in sharp claws, or the noise that it makes when it lunges forward. 
Despite their ferocious reputation, some people do keep them as pets, and as expected, there are reports of one of these birds fatally attacking its owner. Oh, see. One such event happened in Why? Florida. Why? Just get a hamster, for God's sake! When the man was attacked when he accidentally fell to the ground while in the enclosure. After oh the attack, he was surprisingly still able to dial 911, but still succumbed to blood loss, sadly. I'm sorry, like, I know you calling the police is like the first thing, but what's the police going to be able to do? You need to call Ghostbusters or something if that's Claude. Nah, no, no. Number six. No, it's a no from me. Giant desert jellyfish. Two words that you don't usually that's see being used to get jellyfish. Because, oh, mate. well. By the way, apparently it's a myth that peeing on yourself to get rid of the sting doesn't actually work. So you see everyone that's pissed on themselves. Ha! Desert jellyfish. But there you go. I've already used the pair twice and it doesn't get any less weird, especially for me. But even more especially when using the context of this next entry on our list. That's not First real. uploaded to the Video News Viral YouTube channel back in 2014, Is that real? this video reportedly shows a US Army Air Force jet destroying a giant alien monster in the desert. No, I'm not losing my mind. The description actually said U.S. Army Air Force. Is that real? Anyway, whichever part of the U.S. Armed Forces was involved in this, the video actually shows a fighter jet attacking something that I can only describe as a giant jellyfish in the desert. Surely that's just the impact of the explosion and then the sands replicating what a jellyfish looks like. Surely. Is this actual footage of soldiers and giant alien creatures engaging in battle, or is this a weird sequel to Starship Troopers that was so bad it didn't see a theatrical release? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. know. But I certainly hope it's not the latter because the last two Starship Troopers. I think it's just the impact of the explosion. Number five, the lion's mane jellyfish. Ooh. The lion's mane jellyfish is the world's largest that jellyfish. That looks poisonous, Their bells mate. can be over eight feet across, and oh! the jelly have a mass of thin tentacles that resemble a lion's mane, which is where their name originates. Reports oh, of tentacle creepy. size in lion's mane jellyfish vary from 30 feet to 120 feet. Either way, they Can you imagine just swimming around on your holiday, minding your own business, and then you see that? Surely one of those tentacles can make you... Do you not? Know? Nah. Their tentacles no, extend a no. long way and one should give them a very wide berth. This jellyfish also has a ton of tentacles. It has eight groups of them, with 70 to 150 tentacles in each group. These giant jellies are not only large, but also very dangerous. I can imagine. These guys sting, and they sting hard. Uh, not see, enough to be fatal, though, but a sting for one of these creatures is excruciatingly painful. Oh which is God. probably the reason why there aren't a lot of footage of this creature floating around. Thank God! Decided at the end of June 2018, this footage of this beast of a jellyfish was shot when it was spotted in water as shallow as two meters at Maylene Beg Pier. That's what I mean. You could just be swimming around near some coral and then you get this little friend coming up to you say, Hey, fancy getting electrocuted? No. In Ireland. That year, there was an unusually large number of sightings of these creatures in Ireland. Fortunately, Ireland. only a few stinging encounters were reported. Look Number at these fish. Four. These fish are just eating a tentacle. The giant Pacific octopus. Oh, God. We've featured the giant squid and the colossal squid many times in this channel. They're kind of celebrities in this one. I actually had to consciously prevent myself from including them again on this list because of reasons. Anyway, oh. there are other giant invertebrates in the world's oceans, and this is one of them. The giant Pacific octopus grows bigger and lives longer than any other octopus oh species. Oh my god, look, it's so freaky. Is held by a look at that. that. Was 30 feet and by the way, it could get away with looking like a human from a certain distance because you could just think, oh, someone else is scuba diving in the middle of nowhere. Let me just go and say hello. And then you meet this... Brother. Cross and weighed more than 600 pounds. Averages are more like 16 feet and 110 pounds. And although the giant squid and the colossal squid are said to be the inspiration for stories of sea monsters that attack ancient ships, early artist depictions usually feature an oh animal. Oh my god, what is wrong with these divers? They're just the crazy. Octopus. Giant Pacific octopuses have huge, bulbous heads and are generally reddish brown in color. Like the other members of the octopus family, though, oh, they use look special at the way pigment cells in their skins to change colors and textures. Don't open the and eye, can please. Blend in with even the most intricately I don't want to see your eye. Corals, oh my god, look at that. And rocks. In this video, you'll see one particularly large specimen swimming about inland waters of Washington State. Number three. Oh, this is horrible. A giant oarfish. Speaking of real creatures being mistaken for as sea monsters, we have the giant oarfish. Just by looking at one, you'll definitely understand the reason I why. I would not. This is why I don't go into water, you know. massive fish. These guys have been known to reach lengths of up to 110 feet long. 
Honestly, eh? with guys like these, it's no wonder that ancient mariners who saw them told tales of sea serpents. Oarfish are typically found at depths of about 656 feet, but can lurk as- What person in their right mind is going 600 feet underwater? Why? Whatever's- I know like 80% of the ocean is undiscovered. Leave it undiscovered. We don't want- we don't want to see it. As deep is about 3,280 feet, according to the Florida oh, Museum of Natural this. History. It's giving me While anxiety. While biologists don't know why the giant fish comes ashore, they suspect either they are washed towards beaches by storms, or they come to the surface when they're injured or dying. That's, that's why sad. this footage is kind of surprising. It shows a giant oarfish in shallow waters near the shore, but instead of looking sickly or dying, it looks quite energetic. In Japan, this species is traditionally known as a Ryugu no Sukai, or as a Jinja Him, and is believed to be the servant or messenger of the Dragon King, ruler of the sea. Oh. And I kind of want to list about that one, actually. Okay. It is also believed that when an oarfish appears in shallow water, it is a warning that an earthquake or a tsunami is coming soon. That Sorry, how can a fish relay a message saying, Sorry, mate, just to let you know, I've swam all this way, millions of miles or whatever, just to let you know that there's a there's a volcano coming or a tsunami. Yeah, but cheer, cheers, mate. Can you go back and just quickly let him know that we know now? Thanks. Now it's time for the day's best pick. And today we're going to take a look at a photo of a monstrous giant creature that looks more at home in a Godzilla movie than in real life. Which actually begs the question, That's not real. is it real? It's well, not. find out next with number two, the Kaiju. Before proceeding, I'd like to get this out of the way. I can't find any reference to this photo anywhere online. What's it the point? It might have been posted online some time ago and taken down by some secretly funded government agency tasked to police and monitor alien life currently really? living on Earth whose agents are weirdly named after letters of the alphabet, but eh, who knows? Who can say? Oh yeah, the men in black know who he is, do they? In any case, the giant creature depicted in the photo looks a lot like a kaiju in his culture that can usually be seen fighting against robots There's or Godzilla no or Gamera or maybe even actually wait, King Kong is American, I think. It works either way. This photo was sent in by a subscriber, and although I'm pretty sure that it isn't a real animal, it's, that's I thought we'd to look a little deeper into it. It's edited. As we have established earlier, I found nothing. But then again, I found something very similar. That something is a YouTube channel called Hollywood Scotty, who is apparently really good at special effects. He is particularly good at making short videos of giant monsters and alien tripods appearing in various landscapes and cityscapes. The similarities between today's photo and his videos are quite uncanny, which made me think it's probably him that first uploaded it. There's no but way. But one thing we can do to make sure once and for all is to get in touch with the guy. Number one. Giant Oceanic Manta Ray. I've heard the about The giant this. manta ray is the largest ray and one of the largest fishes in the world. Reaching widths of up to 29 feet, the manta rays are much larger than any other ray Jesus species. Jesus Christ. Despite their large size, giant mantas are similar to the largest fishes and the largest marine mammals in that they eat tiny plankton. They constantly swim along with their large mouths open, filtering plankton and other small food from the water. To aid in this strategy, giant mantas have specialized flaps, known as cephalic lobes, which... Now he's talking about flaps. This is dirty. This is dirty. ...help direct more water and food into their mouths. Giant manta rays are found worldwide in tropical, subtropical, and temperate waters and are commonly seen offshore, as well as in oceanic waters and near productive coastlines. They also migrate periodically between warm and cold waters, which is actually the best time to catch them on camera. This video was taken by divers off the coast of Mexico. If you ever wondered how it feels like to fly beside a small airplane, swimming beside one of these guys should give you a pretty good idea. Right, well that's supposedly 10 of the giant creatures caught on camera. I don't personally know how I feel about that. The original link to this video will be in the description as well, just in case you wanted to watch it without my silly face in the middle. Please comment down below what other videos you'd like to see me to react to. It has been your boy Richard Sales Official. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace! <laughs>